So recently I took the last two Rockstar flavors, uh, their focus line was a lemon lime, I don't even remember the other flavor, like that shows how much um, interest I'm holding in this product. Maybe because I've been sucked about having to freaking shoot this thing. Um, Rockstar focus to me is like weird, like it's, it's, it's in the same way as Gatorade Twitch where it's like, I don't know what you're trying to do, because you, we had Rockstar Unplugged, it came out like two years ago, feels like two years ago. Maybe it's longer, three years ago. Maybe, I don't know. Um, I want to see the line do more, but it doesn't freaking help that half the line is only available on the West Coast. Because Rockstar had announced the lemon lime, the orange pineapple, and another flavor that I cannot think of off the top of my head. They were like, hey, you can get these anywhere. Gas stations, Walmart, Kroger, all that. Other half? West Coast. Freaking annoying. Drives me crazy. Uh, but what are my thoughts uh, on the orange pineapple? Now, in the video that you aren't gonna see, I like it a lot. It's like, it's kind of got like an orange sherbet vibe to it, only because of like its orange and pineapple like tropical flavors. It's it's both orange and pineapple and not orange and pineapple at like the same time. Because like I don't know. It's how the flavor mixes and like the lines made. Like lines made has a certain flavor that pairs well. Like love line one, you can barely taste the the lines made because like that is actually really good. Here it's like, I don't know. It's it's trying something. I like it. It's no. it's working for me. I don't like the zero sugar because I can kind of taste it in this one. Um, I love it. I don't like zero sugar products. I think they're disgusting and pointless. Um, but this one's pretty good. I gotta like it a lot. It's. Though I have a lot of guys about Rockstar Energy as a whole from the company, like the the lines they try starting and then dropping, like Rockstar Unplugged was interesting because like, hey, let's do hemp seed in a in slim can product. I think the cans are smaller than this, I think. And then they're like, uh, oh, it's not doing well. Oh, we're not advertising properly. Oh, you can't really find all the products. Oh, well, well it's failed. It's the, it's the distributor's fault. I don't know if that's how it all went down, but how it felt. Like, I remember trying two of them, made a review, and they went to Target of all places and they had it. Like, it was freaking annoying. Um, I, I really want Rockstar Focus to do more and to succeed more, and I think it is. I've heard a lot of, I have heard positive things about Rockstar Focus from other people. Um, so I gotta give this a solid 8.5 out of 10. It's being something in a line that I don't know fully knows what it's trying to do. So hopefully you enjoy a video just like this. Uh, you can follow me at FT, FT underscore for the food news. Uh, we find bloopers and uh, clips and thumbnails and a bunch of other fun stuff there. My podcast and longest podcast on social media platforms. Guys, have a day.